This was the place that I was planning to visit since the past at least 10 to 15 days. But due to shortage of time, we are doing it today. So for you geniuses out there who are trying to guess as to where I'm heading today, hold on bro, I'm gonna tell you exactly where I'm heading to. The destination for today is known as Lopchu. And Lopchu, you get beef momos out there, which happen to be my favorite beef momos in the entire hilly region of Kalimpongwa Darjeeling. At least from the places that I have eaten beef momos. So yes, that's the reason why I'm heading out there and and along with that, I just thought it's been quite a while since we have done a proper travel vlog. So we are going to have fun on the road and on top of that, we are going to test my new mode of vlogging setup as well. Mind you, this new mode of vlogging setup is going to take me at least three times more time to edit my vlogs. Okay, that is the level of dedication that I'm showing to my vlogs currently. So we're not wasting much time. We need to head towards East Main Road as well and pick up Ashmita from there and then head towards Lopchu. And it's already 11.26 right now and by the time I get done with my cold start, by the time I get to Ashmita's place, pick her up, it's gonna be somewhere around 12, 12, 10. And by the time we get to Lopchu, it's gonna be somewhere around, I guess, uh, 1.15, most probably. So we're not wasting much time, let's get on with the ride. So me and Ashmita, we are out from East Main Road. The first place that we'll be heading today is the petrol pump because I am very low on fuel and my happy must be very angry for me for that very reason and I'm trying this new mode of vlogging setup please share your feedback in the description box oh sorry in the comment section the comment section is always open for your precious feedback I really hope it doesn't rain today if it rains then I'm dead. This ladies and gentlemen is main road Kalimpong. For the folks who have never been here. And to head towards Darjeeling, what we need to do is, we need to take the main highway from Chitre. And for Sikkim, we can go through uh, this main highway as well via Chitre or we can even take a route from Dilo, across Dilo, Monsong and then we can directly go to Rompo. Chase out of truth. Or my last ferry ATM or I saw no issue very well. Again, that bugger lost his ATM. <sighs> so, bro, do you see how much fuel my motorcycle consumes? So, please go ahead and share the video. That will help me get more reach and. More reach is equal to more views and more views is equal to more ad plays and more ad plays is equal to more revenue. Please bro, you can do that for me, right? What is there? You just need to share. I'm not asking you for any penny. And since you enjoy watching my video, that can be seen by the number of likes and comments. Well, it doesn't mind to share. Just click the share button, it's hardly gonna take you 10 seconds of your life. There to be a massive waterfall out here. And the water is all dried up bro. This is too much. Seriously, nature has been playing a very tricky game. It's kind of like a punishment for what we have done to the nature over the past years, over the past centuries. 
nature is pulling a major game and if the same continues then i don't think a human race is going to last forever out here No. Trying to synchronize the external audio and the internal audio. Last time we were from here I have to take the video and from here I have to take the audio, right? So it's gonna be very difficult for me to synchronize. I'm not a professional editor to do that. So, so here we are in Peshok. Not exactly Peshok. We haven't reached out here. We are on the way to Peshok and then to Lopchu. And as you can see, I've brought my own bottle of water. I'm gonna explain you the reason why I've brought this bottle of water along with me. So the reason why I brought this bottle of water from my home and I didn't buy it on the road is because when we buy water, we spend 20 rupees. But more important than that, we destroy your environment. If you ask me how, then once you buy the bottle of water, you're not going to take that bottle over to your place and make it a water bottle, right? So might as well when you're coming from a nearby place like Kalimpong, just carry your own bottle of water from Kalimpong or wherever you are from your home basically and take it wherever you want to go to because the most important thing why we drink water is we drink water to get hydrated right and the water from home and the water that you buy from outside it serves the same purpose so you'll be saving 20 rupees and most importantly you'll be saving the environment as well isn't that right and this thing you're not gonna throw it because you have bought this this bottle and when we humans buy something we don't throw it away we preserve it and when we get something for free we just randomly throw it wherever we want to and that is a very bad sign now let's click some pictures then we'll head towards lovers park viewpoint okay let's not stop at lovers park okay? let's not stop at lovers park Okay, then we'll go straight towards Lopchu. Yeah, after when we are returning back, we stop at Lopchu. Yeah, that time my camera will be nicely charged as well, I guess. Yeah. in this place having beef moments i really like the taste out here the first time that i came out here was with my dad that was around three or four years back and after that i used to come out here with my friends and since the beginning of this pan pandemic i didn't really get a chance to come to this part of dodgy lane so yes today i'm having this momo after it's been like what two months uh, two almost two years already If my mom comes to know that I'm eating outside food, I'll have it. <laughs> but trust me, bro, it's awesome. Just imagine, I just spent around 600 rupees in petrol just to come out here and have this. So this has to be good, right? Else, why would I do that? And for Ashmita, well, in the next restaurant, she has ordered roti and sabzi for her. 
but since it's gonna take some time she's not here with me Do I look happy? Yes, I'm very happy. <laughs> Veg momo is from Hard Bazaar Kalimpong. Nothing can beat that. Beef momo is from here, and chicken momo. My aunt's restaurant out there in Line Hotel. Really nice. And are you even a true Nepali if you don't take your momo and dip it in the soup and eat it like this? At least one momo you have to do this. I don't know why, but it's kind of fun, yeah. One with the soup. So I'm almost a pleat down. After this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask for another half a pleat. My regular diet. Atta gatta. Khati pite karka larka. Thumbnail. Now Ashmita, she's finally here. I'm almost done. And yeah, you finally. Hmm? That's nice, on it. KB4. You can't take the smell. But I love. I don't. I love beef momo. You're not chat. So after she gets done with eating, we are gonna. We are not going Lamata, right? We are returning from here, right? But let's just uh, drop by at Anurag's place and say hey, hey, hello, right? Mm. Uncle Auntie Lim, what? I don't think he's there. Last time, I was, uh, last time I was going to Darjeeling, he was there too. Cheese is more harder, but you go and drop and come back. Hmm. So after this, we'll directly head towards Kalimpong, but we'll be stopping in Peshok where we'll be making some cinematic shots for the post credit scene. So this was entirely about today's vlog. I really hope that you folks enjoyed this ride and I hope you're gonna come out here someday and try this thing because it's worth it. Trust me, it's really worth it. And the price is quite... I don't even remember the price the last time. The price was 40 rupees for 8 momos. But you the price of momo? 60. 60 bucks, sir. It's 60 rupees for 8. And it's a pretty good deal. I ate 12 momos. Just imagine 12. It's 60 rupees for, yeah, for that. My total bill is going to be 90 bucks. And what is your bill out there? 50. 50 for 3 rotis and sabzi? Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. So, yeah. This was entirely about today's vlog. I really hope that you folks enjoyed. And until next time, this is your brother, the vlogger from the Hills, Priyam Gurung, and I will see you very, very soon. Till then, take care, bye bye, and cheers to life. And if you are thinking why I'm sweating so much, it's because it's very hot outside, and I just had 12 pieces of really warm momo and the soup. Extra hot. Yeah. Budget mouse, I didn't know. I know. How do you feel? I feel great. I feel great. Ashmita's cucumber. What? No, it's salad. Not exactly salad. A plate of cucumber is gonna cost her 20 bucks. And she'll be having that. And if her stomach permits after that, she'll be having what? Dabai coconut water, that is. And look at the view of Triveni from here. 
simply fantastic, isn't it? At first we thought if you directly stop out there somewhere in Peshok and shoot some cinematic shots, but then we didn't want to because we had like three or four spots where we usually stop and all those spots were occupied and some some or the other construction was going on out there so it kind of broke our heart to see the natural to see that natural beauty fade away and that's the reason why we didn't stop anywhere out there that is it for the vlog bye